So, Mohammed, what's your favourite venue? Uh, <laughs> oh, Ben Dunn. 2020 game at Kangaroo Bay, Glenorchy versus Clarence. Dickie scored 101 out of 110 and had us all ducking for cover. If Greg Beachy doesn't give the same answer, there's something wrong with him. Beach and I umpired a game at Kangaroo Bay where Ben Dunk made 101 out of a score of 110. Uh, we both took a couple of steps backwards and I'm sure Dunkey made them off about 17 balls. Oh, look, I've seen some good ones. Um, best game that I've seen, actually, closest is a third grade match. Um, but the best individual, I would have to say, Justin Reeves from Mowbray when he was bowling. So there's three. So uh, the best bowling I've ever seen was Luke Butterworth, seven for seven against uh, um, Kingborough. Um, took a double hat trick that game. Um, Tim Payne two seasons ago, um, university chasing 300 odd against Newtown, and he made 170, not out. Um, never nicked the ball, it was just pure batting, perfect. Um, and as a team, um, Clarence versus University last season where Clarence won outright in five hours. Um, just great bowling from Steve-O and Rainbird, but also really great batting from um, Michael Jones. It was great, great game, the whole team. Best innings. Oh. There would have to be uh, David Clarence Boone uh, in Launceston with a howling gale when Tazzy were playing Queensland. Uh, Craig McDermott was bowling his fastest and Boone was the only batsman who could hit the ball around the ground and in fact he was hitting McDermott back past his head when no one else could touch the ball. I'd have to be in, I think it was first grade last year, either first or second grade last year. Uh, first over after lunch, came on, first three balls, had to uh, again, coming back to Newtown Oval, was a bloke called Brett Lee in December 1997. I was up by him and said, this bloke come on, and wow, he was quick. He was only a boy then. Um, I was a game down in the TCA. I remember a, uh, um, Michael DiVenuto taking on an informed Tim McDonald who had the ball on the string and it was one of the fan most fantastic battles I've seen and, and Divo did win that day and it was a great thing to watch. Um, Going back quite a few years back, um, I was umpiring in a third grade game in Sydney and there was a first grade cricketer who was dropped um, to the third grade game because he could not go to the net session. So as a punishment, he got dropped to third grade. And uh, funny, he, he bowled from my partners and throughout the day, he didn't get any wickets. And then he came um, from my end after tea, I think, and then he got, got eight for um, for 20 odd runs or something, so that was a quite a devastating spell. Um, and uh, yeah, not that I gave a lot of LBWs or anything, but yeah, it was one of the um, excellent spells I've, uh, I've ever witnessed. Uh, good question. <laughs> <laughs>